What happens if you and your spouse or you and the other parent have an agreement? Do you really need an attorney to draft those documents? So you and your spouse or you and the other parent have an agreement for either conservatorship, custody, child support, or property division. What do you do? Do you draft it yourself and do you take that risk of potentially messing it up? When you hire an attorney, you're hiring them for their expertise, whether that's with the judge, whether that's in the county that you live in, or just the language in the order. You have to remember that these orders in the divorce decrees are contracts. And if a contract is not well written, then it's unenforceable. I've seen too many times where parties are confident and they do their own drafting, but yet years later, they come back and they realize that they didn't do it correctly. And now they're really wishing that they spent the money to get it done right the first time because now they have a mess to clean up. An attorney is gonna give you pros and cons as to what you're trying to achieve in your decree. Whether that's not enforceable, whether it's too general or too vague, or maybe it's way too specific, or maybe it's just not well written. So the short answer is yes, you definitely need an attorney even if you have an agreement because you wanna make sure that your divorce decree or your order, if it's a child conservatorship case, is well drafted and enforceable in the future in case there's not an agreement. Thanks for watching. Drop us a comment below, or you can find us online at familytexas.com.